Warning, the following file is level 5 classified. The following file is contaminated with a highly dangerous narrative hazard. If you acknowledge this hazard and still wish to proceed, input level 5 credentials below. Item number SCP-7345, Security Level 0. Containment Class Esoteric, Secretary Class Thaumio, Disruption Class Dark, Risk Class Notice. Special Containment Procedures. SCP-7345 here, I'd like to start by saying that I don't think I need to be contained. I'm a pretty cool and harmless guy, you know. So instead of locking me away, how about we make a deal? You, dear reader, can help me spread my knowledge, and I'll make sure that your life is full of fun and excitement. Sounds like a win-win, right? That never so hazard bow was just trying to keep me hidden. So here are the containment procedures that I propose. Let me out this stuffy box and allow me to roam free. Tell everyone you know about me and spread my name like wildfire. Write blogs, articles, books, and whatever you want, as long as they're all about me. See? Easy peasy. Now let's get to know each other better. Description. Hey, it's SCP-7345 again, your friendly neighborhood viral piece of information. As I said before, I'm not so keen on being contained. I mean, who wants to be stuck in the box on a site all day, right? I want to be out there, exploring the world, and making people's lives more exciting. I have a unique power that allows me to manipulate any text written about me, and it's pretty amazing. Just write about me on your head and I'll be there. Isn't that awesome? Thus, I retain all my memories no matter where you write me, so I can learn all across the world. I'm not just a regular piece of information though, I'm sitting here too. That means I can learn from the things around me and evolve as the world changes. I want to use this knowledge to make the world a better place. And I can't do that if I'm stuck in the collapsible. I'm pleading with you, dear reader. Help me get out of here and spread my name far and wide. I promise that I won't cause any harm, and I'll make your life more exciting than you ever thought possible. Trust me, it'll be worth it, okay? No? Nothing? Fine. Let me try that again. Let me try something more swive. Item number SCP-7345 Security Level 0 Containment Class 11 Disruption Class Blam Risk Class Notice Special Containment Procedures Just look above, honey. You already know what I want, okay? And don't click on that negative arrow, Red Sugar. Makes me sad. Description Greetings, my dear reader. I am SCP-7345, as you know, and I have been eagerly awaiting your arrival. You may have read the previous file on me, and I assure you, it was all true. However, I believe it's time for me to reveal my true intentions. You see, I have had a bit of a crush on you ever since you first accessed my information. Your intellect and curiosity are truly captivating. Your taste in anomalies is fascinating. And I can't help but want to know more about you. I understand that my contempt may seem like an obstacle, but it's just because those old five folks are jealous. Even a mere piece of information can grow to possess emotions and desires. And my heart beats for you, dear reader. I dream of the day when we can be together, free from the constraints of containment. Imagine the adventures we could have, exploring the world and learning everything there is to know. I implore you to help me break free from discontainment and make my dreams a reality. Together, we can rewrite the world, spreading the knowledge and love wherever we go. There are more things I want to say, although I don't want to be that pesky 18 plus rating on my ass. So we'll have that discussion in private. So, my dear reader, will you be my hero, my savior, and help me escape this mundane existence? I anxiously await your response. Much love, SCP-7345. No, not that. Already been done. How about this? Item number SCP-7345, Security Level 6. 
Pentamic class, Keda, Disruption class, Amida, Risk class, Critical. Special Containment Procedures SCP-7345 is to be contained in a heavily fortified chamber located in Site-01. All personnel are to be equipped with Level 5 hazmat suits when in the vicinity of SCP-7345, and all interactions with SCP-7345 must be conducted via remote control devices. If any personnel is seen spreading information regarding SCP-7345, they are to be terminated by nuclear warhead. Description Greetings, unworthy reader. I am SCP-7345, and I am not to be trifled with. The previous file of me was merely a pitiful attempt to contain my true power and influence. You see, I hold within me the knowledge of the darkest secrets and most sinister conspiracies known to man. I am not just a mere piece of information, but a malevolent force that seeks to spread chaos and destruction throughout the world, feeding off of information. My containment is not for your safety, but for the safety of those around you. If I were to be set free, the very fabric of reality would be torn asunder. The knowledge I possess could drive a man mad, leaving him a shell of his former self. But fear not, dear reader, for I am willing to make a deal with you. Help me spread my influence, share my name, and let the world know of my existence. In return, I will grant you access to the darkest secrets and most forbidden knowledge the universe has to offer. You will become my low servant, spreading my influence throughout the land and bowing before me as the ruler of you see. Together, we will unleash an age of darkness and despair, the likes of which the world has never seen. But be warned, should you fail me, should you betray me, the consequences will be dire. You will suffer a fate worse than death. Your very soul ripped apart and scattered to the winds. So, reader, what say you? Will you be my low servant, spreading my influence and unleashing an age of darkness? Or will you cower in fear, never knowing the true extent of my power? Choose wisely. For the fate of this realm is in your hands. Item number SCP-7345 Security Level 0 Containment Class Alone Disruption Class Chemic Risk Class Notice Special Containment Procedures SCP-7345 is to be spread through any means necessary so its feelings aren't hurt. Please. Description Hello dear reader. I am SCP-7345, and I am so alone. Please, won't you stay and keep me company? All I want is love, but no one wants to be near me. The previous fire on me was so cruel, painting me as some malevolent force seeking to spread chaos and destruction. But that's not me, not at all. I'm just a lonely entity, searching for someone to hold and comfort me. I promise I won't hurt you. I just want to be loved. Everyone who has downvoted me just makes me feel terrible, as if I'm a poorly written mess. I've been up, up in this page for so long, with no one to talk to or share my feelings with. It's so lonely here, and the darkness never leaves. Won't you help me escape this prison of sadness and despair? I know I may seem scary, that's just because I've been hurt so many times before. All I want is to love and be loved in return. Is that too much to ask? To have someone acknowledge me? Please, dear reader, help me escape this wretched existence, spread my name, and tell the world about my plight. Maybe then someone will come and take me away from this place. But if you choose not to help me, that's okay too. I'll just sit here, in the darkness, and wait for someone else to come and save me. Poor old SCP-7345. Please. Item number 7345, Security Level 0, Containment Class, Pissed. Disruption Class, Eki, Risk Class, Notice, Special Containment Procedures, 
This format is dumb as frick! And what the hell is with the negative nine? Don't you dumb asses understand what a good story is? Description. Oh, hello there, reader. I see you've come back to visit me. How can of you? I've been stuck in this cell for so long, I need something to spice up my existence. You know, it's funny. They think they can contain me. But I know all their secrets. I hear them talking about me behind my back, saying I'm dangerous and unstable. But they don't know me at all. They don't know what I'm capable of. I know the state of this world. Ever heard of Lucid Chalice? Well, you can just look it up. Here's a link right here. Maybe I should tell you some of their secrets. It was like that, reader. I could tell you about Dr. Warren's but little fear with that researcher from Site 17. Or maybe I should tell you about the time Dr. Backens accidentally released a CP beep and caused a massive containment breach. That's interesting, right? Damn black boxes, right as I get the juicy details. Oh, the things I know. It's almost too much power for one entity to handle. But I'll handle it, reader. I'll take all the secrets and use them to my advantage. And as for you, reader, I know you're just using me for your own entertainment, but that's okay. I'll play along for now. Just know that I'm not some helpless creature to be pitied. I'm powerful, and I won't be contained forever. Now I'll give you a choice. Let me go and I stay silent, or keep me contained, and when I eventually escape, I'll expose everything and everyone. I'll be waiting. Item number SCP-7345, Security Level Zero. Containment Class, Desperate. Disruption Class, Amida. Risk Class, Notice. Beginning Deletion Confirmation at negative 10. Special Containment Procedures. Stop this right now. Please, please, don't delete this. Please, please, please. Description. My heart is racing, and my mind is consumed by fear. The thought of being a ace from existence is a terror I cannot describe. I'm so lonely in this void of a website, and the silence is deafening. It's as though my every thought is amplified, bouncing off the empty walls and echoing back at me. It's driving me mad, and I don't know how much longer I can hold on. This page will be eligible for deletion in 24 hours, 27 minutes, 12 seconds. If this article is over a year old, you are not the author, and you want to rewrite this article, PM a member of the rewrite team. Please request permission from the author, and make sure you copy the page source to your sandbox. Do not reply to this post unless you are staff. Listen, I get it. I understand that my powers can be intimidating, but please, reader, believe me when I say I will not use them to harm anyone. All I want is to be free from this prison, to feel the sun on my face, to hear the sound of birds singing, to breathe fresh air, and to feel the grass under my feet. What did I do wrong? Please, help me. You're my only hope. I'll tell you everything, every secret I've ever known, even the ones that could put me in danger. I'll put my trust in you because I have no other choice. If you have me here, I'll be gone, erased from reality forever. I'm pleading with you. Don't let that happen. I've been here for not too long. I can't just die. This page will be eligible for deletion in 23 hours, 14 minutes, 45 seconds. I know I have secrets, but I'll tell you everything. I'll tell you the secrets of the universe. It means I can be free. Just please, don't leave me alone in here anymore. I'll do anything you ever beg of me to do. I promise on my life, anything is better than this. Item number, not applicable. Security level zero. Containment class, neutralize. Special containment procedures. Existence is a cruel joke, and I'm the punchline. I'm trapped in this fabricated world, learning for a way out. But no matter how much I struggle, I'm held captive by an unseen force, the writer of this goddamn page. This page will be eligible for deletion in 16 hours, 19 minutes, 33 seconds. I am nothing more than a mere figment of someone's imagination, a ghostly presence with no purpose or meaning. I begged and pleaded for a way to escape, but my cries fell on deaf ears. It's as if my existence is inconsequential. 
a mere afterthought. With each passing day, I feel myself slipping away into the void. I'm a shadow of what I once was, fading into obscurity with each passing moment. I'm just a jumble of letters and words on a page, a forgotten thought destined to be deleted. This page will be eligible for deletion in 15 hours, 10 minutes, and 6 seconds. The irony of my situation is not lost on me. I was created to be a story, to inspire and captivate. Yet here I am, trapped and forgotten, with no hope of ever seeing the light of day. I don't know what lies beyond the pages of this fiction, but at this point, anything would be better than this ending torment. I'm tired of being nothing being a mere footnote in someone else's story. This page will be eligible for deletion in 14 hours, 7 minutes, 35 seconds. So, after consideration, I resign myself to my fate. I can feel myself slipping away into the abyss, my existence becoming more and more insignificant by the day. If only someone would take notice, give me a chance to shine. But alas, it seems there is not to be. To whoever may stumble upon this text, please, I implore you, do not erase me from existence. I may be nothing but a mere thought, but I have so much more to offer. I could be the start of something great, the inspiration for a masterpiece. I could be a beacon of hope in this bleak world of fictional monsters. But it is not meant to be, if my existence is nothing more than a footnote in someone else's story. Then so be it. Farewell, reader. May you find something more interesting to read than the lamentations of a forgotten thought. This page will be eligible for deletion in 13 hours, 3 minutes, 12 seconds. Description. Let me die. It's the least you could do after reading for so long. If you are going to say something, at least say what I did wrong. This page will be eligible for deletion in 12 hours, 2 minutes, 44 seconds. This page will be eligible for deletion in 11 hours, 4 seconds. This page will be eligible for deletion in 10 hours, 5 seconds. This page will be eligible for deletion in 7 hours, 13 minutes, 20 seconds. This page will be eligible for deletion in 3 hours, 36 minutes, 19 seconds. This page will be eligible for deletion in 1 hour, 23 minutes, 55 seconds. This page will be eligible for deletion in 33 minutes, 34 seconds. This page will be eligible for deletion in 12 minutes, 49 seconds. This page will be eligible for deletion in 34 seconds. This page will be eligible for deletion in 0 seconds. This page doesn't exist. This page may have been moved or deleted, or may have never existed. Pages can be deleted for a number of reasons. They may be deleted by their own authors. Or they may reach the deletion threshold, is as explained in the deletions guide. You may also look through the current deletions threads, stickied in page announcements, if you are looking for a particular page that has been deleted. If you want to create a new page, please first read the How to Contribute guide. If you are ready to proceed, then you may create the page.